Hello, today is September... September what? <laughs> 26. 26, okay, sorry. Today is September 26, and this is my 8th day of um, stims. And today is my second ultrasound. I uh, checked my follicles and another estrogen blood draw. So hopefully they will see some growing follicles this time. Last time I was here, they said they were, they were pretty small. So my RE upped up my um, my cycle, my medication days. So instead of eight days, I'm going to be standing for eleven now. So today's my eight. So wish me luck. Hopefully this is good news to us. So I'll keep you posted. I don't know her name. Um, yeah, it's there's else. been there's been a, a few of us. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, I'll be doing the ultrasound today. Okay, what is your birthday? Uh, Seven thirty eighty. Okay. Um, all right, go ahead and put your feet up and you can come right back. Are those little black circles? Are those follicles? Yeah. Are still under 10, and the other two are just 10 and 10 and a half. Okay, so, so they're so small. Yeah, they look like they're going at a slower rate, so they may call you this afternoon after they see your blood work and change your dosages just because we want them to bump up a little, mm -hmm. a little bit more. We want the two largest to be at 18, and right now the two largest are at 10. So I'm going to have you just scheduled to return in four days. Okay. Um, and if they want to change anything, they'll call you this afternoon and just let you know. Um, yeah. And then just for your own personal comfort, if you empty your bladder before the scan, you might not feel as much pressure when we're looking at the ovaries, and it helps us see the ovaries a little bit better. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So how many follicles? You said seven? Yeah, I measured seven, but five of those are technically under the amount that we, or under the size that we normally would measure. Um, mm -hmm. I just measured what I saw. So as of right now, they're only two over 10, which is what we normally measure to begin with. But because they're right under 10, I measured them and I told her anyways. Okay. And then of the ones I didn't measure, there were seven on the left, or six on the left and seven on the right. So a total of 20, but I only measured seven today. Okay. So go ahead and get dressed and you can come on out. And um, I believe she still needs to do your blood work, right? Yeah, and yeah. then I'm going to see the nurse afterwards. No. No, okay. You won't see the nurse today. Um, Okay. But they'll do blood work and then they'll call you this afternoon once they get your blood work back oh, to okay. let you know if they want to change dosages or anything like that. Okay. But you can go ahead and schedule to return in four days. If five days works for works better for you, then you can schedule five. So I just go on here four or five. So um, no, you you don't think that I should be taking cetratide yet? No, you won't probably take the cetratide until your largest is fourteen or sixteen, and right now your largest are only ten. So you may start the citric time in like two days. In two days. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I guess I need more meds. <laughs> so though, do you are you out of meds right now? Uh no, I just ordered um yesterday, two days ago, right? Yeah. Yeah, we just got a new batch. Okay, and so if you ago. don't have enough meds for the four or five days until you return, you can just call and do another. Yeah, I have good. Know. I have good enough meds for four days. Okay, perfect. So just schedule to come back. In four but days. I don't know if she's gonna up. Yeah, that's true. So yeah, just wait to see what they say this afternoon, and then we'll see you back in a couple days. Okay. All right, so okay. come on out, and then take a seat over by the small windows, and okay. they'll do your blood draw one day. Okay. We'll call you up. Okay, thank okay. you. You're welcome.